Hey guys, today we are at Ross Dress for Less and I got my special guest Rachel here with us today. We're going to go look at some, I don't know, hopefully some good deals. We're going to see what they got. Think they're going to have anything good in here? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, I guess we're not going to Ross. Been lied to. We have been lied to. The conspiracy theories are true. Ross is shutting down. Well, I guess we'll walk around here. It's got to be something open here. Somewhere. All right, guys, we are back, and this time we are at the officially canceled Ulta Beauty. And yes, I am still here with Rachel, and we're going to try this again. Hopefully they're not closed for maintenance like, like Ross. No. So we're going to head inside, and we're going to check out some beauty products. Mm. Hello. Alright guys, we are officially inside of Ulta Beauty. Today we're going to go look at some makeup. Something with some pigmentation. Oh, we're gonna need a good foundation, ain't we? I'm pretty wide, I ain't no foundation. <laughs> Anastasia? Yes, we live for Anastasia. Oh, none of these are really pigmented. Oh, natural colors. We're not living for the natural colors. We're looking for the rainbows. We're looking for the rainbows, the glitters, the red hots. Ooh, look at that. That's going to burn somebody. <laughs> not me snorting on camera, though. You're welcome. Here we go. Now we're talking. Look at that. Ooh, look at that color right there. Some of the gold? The... The Dumb Luck Shimmer. Yes, we're living for that. The Floored Metallic. Set Mist Metallic. We're, I'm living for those colors right there. And who is it from? Does it say? Are they just singular shades? I wonder how much those are. Whew, my heart just popped. My heart just populated. Oh, look at these colors. Look at this. See, this is the type of eye I want to give you right here. That's what I want to give right, right there. But you're not really a blue color. You're more of a burgundy or yeah, a burnt colors, orange. Like your reds, your oranges. Mm -hmm. yeah. So we've got to find like a burnt orange color somewhere that is That's very, like. <laughs> very, you're not, well, you do look kind of burnt today. Uh -huh. We need to find a very pigmented, burnt color. Those are reds, more blushes. Oh, your favorite full-sized and fun-sized, right? That's literally me. Wait, <laughs> I, somebody hire me for this campaign. Full-sized and fun-sized. <laughs> Para Espanol, a primo dos. Spark Black Song, Pure. I wonder if they got the oh, Jeffrey's. Girl. We found it. We have found it. Morphe X Everything. 90. Look at these colors. And I can't look at these colors. You can open it and look at these colors. And that totally just came out. Look at these colors, guys. I'm not going to lie. I'm in love with like Wow. Colors. Those are really nice colors. Test the pigmentation on the orange. This one? Yes. Wow, look how bright that is. Yes! Whoa. We are living. I am never going to get this off. Wait, I have hand sanitizer. Maybe get a little purple beside the orange right here. Kind of mixy, mixy. Ooh, look at that, team. guys. Wow. See, this is what we're looking for. This might be the Z palette right here, guys. Look at that. I'm actually impressed. And this palette is called fierce fairy tale so guys make sure you check this palette out because i'm actually impressed at the pigmentation 
It's not moist. It's not too dry. It's very it's mate. Very much is sticking up there. But it's she's got a good shimmer, and she is. Look at that. She's staying up there pretty good. Oops, sorry, I just made it worse on you. No, it's fine. I'll put. So yeah, the the Morphix uh, Niani, if I'm saying it wrong, forgive me. But yeah, that that fierce fairy tale. I'm living for that right now. Now, I'm wondering if they got Jeffree Star in here. Let's go take a look. Get L, cruelty free. I'm not seeing any Jeffree Star. Hmm. Usually Jeffree Star would be in the Morphe area. Oh, that's Morphe Jeffree Star split ways, remember? Oh, yeah, they So, did. we remember. need, maybe they could be in another section of the store at a discounted price, and we live for a good discount. The Simpsons Revolution palette. This is cute. It's giving me 70s. It really is. It's giving me 70s vibes, too. Especially with but, you know, 70s are in right now, you know. They're in right now, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if they have a, uh, like a clearance section. I really want to know if they get the Shane Dawson palette. That's the one. But if they don't have the Shane Dawson palette, then that one that we looked at, you should definitely get that. It's a very, very tiny radar, but I'm pretty sure it's there somewhere. Hello, how are you, dear? So here we have the LA Girl, the BH Cosmetics, Juvia's Place. A lot of y'all are familiar with Juvia's Place. It's a pretty popular brand around here and in Houston. ColourPop. I think they recently just came out with some new stuff right here. Ooh, look at the high tide colors, though. Those are cute. Maybe on your white skin. Nude. No, we're not living for the nude. But I do kind of like the oranges here. Guys, look at this one here, though. It's a cute palette, but it looks very messy. Very messy. I was gonna say muddy. Or, or muddy. Those greens are cute. I live for greens that don't do well on my face. Not them no. coming. I feel like that they came for Jeffree Star on that one palette that we tested out. Because uh -huh. they used the Morphe X, even though Morphe X is its own brand. Yeah. You would think they would have switched it up. Look at the more the new Morphe X pony. I'm not living for it. It's a lot of natural colors and some swirls, but the best one that I have seen right here is definitely the Fierce Fairy Tale. So what do you think? I agree. I think I think that's cool. That's because that's the one. Well, let's grab one and we will walk around and look around some more. Oh, she's a heavy palette. Let me see. Oh, she that is heavy. Has weight. This does have weight. That means it's yes, good quality. That's right. Worth it. Worth it. Worth it. Spoil yourself. Yes. <laughs> the bad part is we don't even know how much it is. Did you see how much? I don't know how to not spoil myself. Okay. Yes, okay. work it. We don't know how to not do it. Work that palette. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to get you a brand deal in no time. These are pretty. Those this are is the natural. Warrior by Juvius. Very natural colors for people with darker complexions. Which I think is very, very pretty. I've seen those actually. I've seen some people oh, on YouTube. Can't test those. No. I've seen some people on YouTube actually get those to test out on camera for people. Those are really pretty. Yeah, though, I think that's really cool that they came out with that. And uh, I do believe that um, Rich Lux has tested this palette and made a video with it with the makeup oh, really? look. Yes, so that's pretty cool. They got a lot of shimmers in that one too. They do. Okay, so we have our base. Is there anything else you think we should get with that? You have eyeliner we're already. Are you sure we don't need any like foundation or? Foundation, if you want. I don't know what kind of. Uh, you're probably your skin tone. We're probably gonna need about a thirty, which is a little bit darker than the one that you got. Asian, like my last one. The one, the last one was a twenty-five, which is five shades too light. Uh, we need concealer, right? Oh, concealer. We need. Wait, is this foundation or is this concealer? What is this? 
Nap time fully lost. These are all concealers. We need a good foundation. Concealers. Oh wait, there's some foundations down there, right? Yes. Face tape foundation. I think you need, let's take a look. These are all testers here. I'm trying to see 22, 27, 29. That's what I usually this do, it's one, a light medium sand. This one's, can't see if it's a little blurry. Double Duty Beauty, number 29, this is tart. You want me to hold the palette so you can test that on your skin? Sure. Where should I test it? Um, on the bottom side of your wrist where it's lighter. Where I'm lighter, huh? Yes. Whoa, oh, that actually spreads... A lot more than I expected uh, for that yeah, little bit. I regret putting that much on. <laughs> it's actually a really decent color for your skin, though. It is. If you don't put... All this leftover orange in it. She, she, she puts so much on that little bitty job. I it's didn't crazy. need it! <laughs> I but have regrets. I have to admit, once it's blended in, it looks really good. Yeah, it does. So it looks like I almost shaved. We will have your face and your neck matching in no time. Yeah. With enough beating my face up. Yes. So I think you should get that color, but do they have it? And that was number 29. Uh, That's 22. Yeah, 29, 29 in right here. Oh, it's so small. Oh, it's a try me for 16. Bottle. Yes. We live for a good deal. That's right. So I think we're good. We got the palette, guys. This is the palette that we're going to be trying. And number 29 right here, the face tape. Now, I will say I do like tart makeup. I've actually gotten a lot of tart before. Yeah. I started with concealer and worked my way out, you know. I think we're going to make a... I think I'm going to do really good with the look this time, guys. Because this color is... The colors in this palette is just ridiculous. And in case y'all didn't see it, I'm going to show you one more time. And if you want to know where to get it, you get it from Ulta Beauty. I don't know if they have it on their website, but if you want to check, you can go to ultabeauty.com. But here's the palette right here. It's called Fierce Fairy Tale. And those are the colors. Let me know in the comments, guys, which colors you want me to use on Rachel. So, until next time, guys, we're out of here. I took my mask off, so I'm not going to reveal myself. But the next time you see Rachel, she's going to be made up. So, yeah. goodbye.